So we're on a whirlwind tour of the Oyster Shed in the city of London, underneath the Bank of Nemura, right by the Thames. This is, this is Geronimo growing up after, after playing with lots of little pubs in the, in the residential suburbs, the nice suburbs of London. Uh, by the way, we've got Ray and Mark over there sorting out some new dishes for us. Going to take you around the pub. So this is a pub. It's all about great beers. We've got beers from Germany, ciders from Suffolk. If you fancy a little something a little just to perk you up in the morning, we've got fantastic baristas working in here. Wine is one of our passions. Our wines are chosen by John, who is a master of wine. He's got his top tipple for us this week, the Wakefield 80 Acre Chardonnay Viognier. More beers, we've got Kirinichi Ban, obviously being under the Bank of Nomura. It's good to have some Japanese beers. And ales are one of our passions. We've got Young's Bitter, we've got Sharp's Doom Bar, we've got Bombardier, we've got some Dark Star over the moon. We're going through a bit of an ale festival. Something a little bit stronger, fantastic malts. If you fancy out sitting outside, watching the sun go down over the Thames with a nice Cuban Havana, you can just transform yourself, move away from, from London a little bit. Upstairs, yet another bar. You can rent the whole of this floor. You can come up here for lunch, for dinner. You can find out where. I was skiing there last week. You can find out where you've been in Europe. You can have a little cozy fun down here. You can stand up the top. You can see Simon setting up the bar. You can just watch all the people in the evenings through here into the captain's table. This is like the bridge of the ship. This is where the captain can have his nice lunch or, or you can come in here. You can have a dinner for 25, 20, 25 in here. You can have drinks. You can do a presentation. Look at those views. It's fantastic. The Shard. You've got HMS Belfast down there. You've got the Tower of London. Imagine what this is like with the flotilla going past for the Jubilee. What more could you ask for? So we're going to take you away from the captain's table now. We're going to go down to the lower decks. See how this big ship really does sail. It's not a view you often get in a pub, but we thought, why not? People like to see how it works. Yesterday's specials, catch of the day, the Shed Express. You get, if you fancy a quick lunch, you get two or three courses delivered to you on one plate at the same time. None of this waiting for the next course. You can get out of here in a hurry. That's what you need in the city. Quickly say hello to the guys in the kitchen up here. Morning, boys. How are you doing? Now this is the cold store. Not many people often go into these sort of places. We're a little tight on space, but you've got a lovely range of bottled beers. You've got Budvar Dark, voted the best beer in the world last year. You've got Sierra Nevada Pale Ale, Coopers, fantastic beer from Australia. This is where it all happens though. This is the beer. This is what people are coming to the pub for. These are the keg beers. So you've got your, you've got your Heinekens, you've got your Aspals, you've got your Bitburgers. The real ales. This is a real craft. Everyone who comes in and has a pint of real ale just thinks, oh, okay, they've just chucked that on. These have to be settled. They have to be conditioned. This is live. This is, it's continually working. That is a tour of the oyster shed. This is where all the hard work happens. So that When you come in, order a pint or order a glass of wine or, or want to have a really nice meal, all this work has been going on. This is what it's about, being in a pub. <laughs>